Hello beautiful people of the internet. My name is Ryan. I hope you all are doing well. Make sure to leave a comment below and let me know how you're doing. So today I thought I would do a video for you where I would talk about dreams. So I'm sure all of us have had a dream at some point in our lives and um, most recently I had a dream. I don't dream a lot um, and usually actually they're like bad dreams if I do dream or like scary dreams. So I had a dream anyways um, the other night. <clears throat> Girl, let me tell you, I was on a reality show on Bravo. <laughs> yeah, I was awesome. Um, just in case you're watching Bravo, totally will take a reality show or at least a spot on one if you've got one. Um, so anyways, I was on a reality show and I was at a dinner party with friends. I knew these people like in my dream, don't really know them in real life. Anyways. They were like, oh, we're waiting on a few people to arrive. Once they get here, we can start dinner. And I was like, okay, not no biggie. So I'm sitting at the table, and I actually happen to be sitting next to the two empty seats of the next two people coming to the party. So I'm sitting there, and I'm like, oh my gosh, who's going to come? Who's going to come? So there's a knock at the door. The person whose house it is goes up, goes to answer the door, pulls open the door, and it's somebody from my past. And my gut instantly was in my throat and I was like oh my gosh so I just kept my cool kept my cool she comes over she sits on the table she's like hi and I was like oh hi and I you know I was really polite and everything and sat down and this person like dug right into me I kept my cool didn't really say anything and I was just like uh and like they went out on me let them then I said to them, this is like none of your business, da 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 And I cut them right off. It was amazing. I never raised my voice, totally owned myself, had my glass of wine, like, bitch, what? Yes. So, just in case you're watching, Bravo, I know how to handle myself on reality television, but don't worry. We can still bring some of the drama. So, anyways, then the person ended up getting up and leaving, which was awesome. And, yeah, so, anyways, I tried Googling that. I mean, I was like... So, dear Google, um, what does it mean if you dream about being on a reality show and running into somebody in your past and owning them? And then talking about it after. I couldn't find an answer. Like, nobody else has Googled this before. Really? Really? Just kidding. So, anyways, that was just a crazy weird dream that I had. I kind of do wish that I could, like, interpret that dream further, but whatever. So... What I was going to say was, do you ever have like a dream or you see a sign or something? Like one of my friends was having a dream um, about like reoccurringly drowning. <clears throat> Looked it up, kind of had to deal with some stuff that she had going on in her life. Or have you ever seen a symbol or like an animal like a ton of times or something like that? Like you keep running into something. So recently I keep running into spiders. And at first I was like, okay, maybe there's just like a spider invent in infestion or infestion? I don't know, whatever. Uh, so then I was like, so maybe there's like a spider issue or something, but I kept running into them a ton of different places. Like it wasn't just at my house. Like they were in my car, they were in my house. They were like everywhere that I seemed to turn. I feel like I would run into a spider. So anyways, I was like telling her about this, like one of my best friends about this. And she like looked at, she looked it up online and she, she read me the definition. So I thought we would interpret some dreams or maybe you could like post down below any dreams that you've had, maybe the interpretation of your dreams or if you keep running into an animal or something that you keep running into that can mean something else. The spider is a remarkable figure of feminine energy and creative in the spirit animal kingdom. Spiders are characterized by the skilled weaving of intricate webs and patience in awaiting their prey. By affinity with the spider spirit animal, you may have qualities of high receptivity and creativity. Having the spider as a power animal or a totem helps you tune into life's ebbs and flows and ingeniously weave every step of your destiny. Spider meanings. Common meanings of the spider spirit animal are patience, receptivity, feminine energy, creativity, weaver of life's fate. The way that I see it is that I'm going on the light side of spiders. Um, I've really just started to like make videos and start to really get creative in that sense and just come up with different video ideas and stuff like that, which 
is really awesome and exciting. And I'm taking my own fate in the sense of I'm putting myself out there so that I have the opportunity to hopefully one day be on TV or to be popular on YouTube. And that's really exciting and not even necessarily be popular on YouTube, but it's a stepping stone maybe in the right direction for, you know, I see all these YouTubers who have started on YouTube and now they have the opportunity to be on TV and film and stuff like that, which is where I want to go. Right now I'm going to school for broadcasting mass communications. Um, and I just think this is a really great platform to start on. And I also think that it's a really great practice in a sense too. You know, I would totally make a career out of YouTube and I hope to at some point hopefully make a career out of, out of YouTube. So yeah, so I'm really excited. But anyways, hopefully you guys will leave your ideas or dreams or anything like that that you guys, or symbols, anything that you've had in your past um, or recently below. All my social media links are down below, so make sure you check those out. Give me a follow. Let me know that, that you followed me from my YouTube channel. And of course, don't forget to share your smile with the world. I love you all. Bye! And I mean, girl, can I just say that I feel like a real housewife right now? I feel like I'm doing one of my commentaries like, Ooh, girl, that bitch wanted to throw down with me, but I don't think so. I owned her ass. Mm, she was throwing all sorts of crap. Let me just tell you, you don't come to my dinner party, my friend's dinner party, and try to own me. I don't think so. Pfft, I'm done with this interview.